been a while. It's been a while since I've streamed Final Fantasy. It's been a while. So, here's the plan, here's the plan. At long last, I am going to actually do the storyline. So I've been leveling, I've been leveling my Dark Knight uh, off stream so that we can actually just jump straight into the Dark Knight story at the very least until the end of Heaven's Sword contents um, so we can do the Dark Knight storyline right up until uh, level a new level 54 so like we don't have to level every, wait for every five level like we're supposed to and once we're done with that we can do the Hildebrand storyline once I'm done with the Hildebrand storyline I would probably end the stream there right there I could do some beast tribes before we end it once we settle that once we settle that we can finally finally get back into um, Stormblood so um, yeah. So uh, let's see. Let's let's begin. Let's begin. No point waiting. All right. So where is our friend? All right, our friend is up here, Mr. Frey. As you can see, I'm um, I'm not going with the traditional Dark Knight look. Uh, this other this other guy looks pretty dark knightish, with the starting armor. Looks good. Uh, this is me. <laughs> My sword is a little fancier than his. Haha. <laughs> All right, Frey, what's up? I had a feeling you'd come by today, Tian. Sure enough, there you are, eager to pick up where we left off. Yeah, that's right, we're picking up where we left off. Alright. Yeah, I don't know, let's ask about the old lady and the granddaughter. Yeah, what happened to the girls? Alright, they're fine. Okay, that's good. So what is the voice that I heard? That dark voice, once I picked up the soul jam. It's a beacon guiding the Dark Knight to his true calling. Whose is it? Only I can discover. Then why do I bother asking you? Come on. Each knight hearkens to a different voice. As I grow more accustomed to drawing upon my dark side, I will hear it more clearly. Communion will hasten the process. But we do not conduct the rites here under the Eye of the Hood. What kind of rites? We make for Thanalan. Little Alamigo, okay. For some reason, it always ends up back in Little Alamigo. Pretty far away from Ishgard. Alright. For some reason, everyone loves standing here. Alright, what's up, Frey? Communion is a ritual which one nurtures the darkness so that he may channel it more effectively in battle. If I partake it in excess, I die. Okay. Okay, before we begin, he wants me to do a favor. What favor? Oh, uh, fine, fine, I'll kill something for you. Something feral and fearsome. Alright, let's ask the old bear. Alright, gonna bolt. Give me something fearsome to kill. Red Labyrinth. Okay. Alright, the Pistis attack caravans loaded with Elgood carcasses. 
Okay. Interesting. He sends something burning in me. He thinks it's passion, but we'll see what it is. Ah, Free is just waiting right here. Okay. Let's eat something before we start. Mm -hmm. Marmot steak. Alright, so he just wants me to show him what I can do. Alright, fine, fine. Yours. There we go. Easy enough. To meet out justice to protect the weak from the strong. I myself must be strong. Strength is pain, strength is suffering, strength is sacrifice. Okay, pretty edgy, but no okay, okay. Pretty edgy, pretty edgy. Alright, right back to little Alamigo. Okay. <laughs> oh, standing on the edge. So edgy. <laughs> All right, Mr. Edge Lord, what's up? Close my eyes and hold out my hand towards him. Breathe deep through my nose. So are we doing Tai Chi now? Okay. Listen to my voice, listen to your heart, my heart. Listen to his voice, listen to my heartbeat, listen for the other. All right, so, so we are doing Tai Chi. What's going on? With every breath, I grow lighter and sleep further into. So, what? Tai Chi sends us into the dark side? What the hell? <laughs> okay. Oh, wait. Like, did, did I just faint? One foot in front of the other over and over again. To the ends of the world and back again. If time has no end, still forward and onward. Over and over again. What the? What the fuck does that mean? Interesting, but not terribly informative. That's right. I've heard Confucian sayings that are less cryptic. I'll come to understand its meaning in due time. Okay. In some instances, the voice is said to be that of another. One whom the Dark Knight is fated to seek out. If that is the case, I'll have a long journey ahead of myself. I will welcome that journey. Mm -hmm. Something said, and for travel, and for that matter, to roam free and help those in need. Uh, that's noble. No good deed goes unpunished. <laughs> he knew a man once, wanted to be a great hero, do great things, and so he did. The song always ends there, but life doesn't, doesn't. That's true. That's true. 
there are temptations more deadly than the dark side. Yeah, like good food, relaxing, drink, and other stuff. Alright. I should have learned this by now, but I haven't and I will. The communion has ended and our time together. We shall meet again as we did before. Um, back in Ishgard. Blood web. Restore MP upon landing weapon skills or spells. Doesn't work if you doesn't work extra if AOE. Cryptic. Very cryptic. Alright, I'm assuming I have to head back to Ishgard. You seem to be like standing where you died, huh, Free? What's this? Edge of Darkness. Grunts Dark Sight, increasing damage by 10%. Isn't it the same as. Alright. Yeah, I've not heard the voice since. We've only been away for a while. I find it if the dark side is strong. Well, oh, so we hang on. Am I becoming a Sith Lord? If only you knew the power of the dark side. Back to. So, why we? Why do we keep going back to Thanalan? So he wants me to meet him at the Burning Wall. All right. For some reason, a lot, a lot of this happens in Thanalan. I suppose. That's because, um, I think one of the primary gods of Thanalan is, uh, Thal, or Nathal. That, that's the god of death in Final Fantasy XIV, if I'm not wrong. It's been a while since I've been back here. Ooh. Look at the waterfall. Pretty. Never noticed this before. begins as always with blood and a confirmation of my identity. Well, we are our blood. That's true. There are X beaks we have grown more ferocious beyond reckoning. Alright, you want me to kill them, right? Alright, fine, I'll kill them. Does someone need help there? Right, I guess I'll help. This is...
Alright, let's kill whatever we need to kill for free. Ooh. Two of them. That it? Alright. Ah, oh, so he's happy to see what I guess it. <laughs> yeah, it is a pointless trial. Uh huh. Oh, this is his death. Dark Knights are definitely Sith Lords. Remember this feeling. Remember the hate. Let it empower you. <laughs> All right. So remember the feeling of this frustration. Okay, fine, fine. I guess that a boat right back to Camp Drybone. So we're gonna commune with the next level and go closer to the dark side. All right, where are you free? Here you are. All right, Vader. Close my eyes, hold my hand out, breathe deep through my nose. Do Tai Chi, slower and slower. All right. Who is this? Isambard. Oh yeah, yeah, I remember you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you need my help? What's up? What's going on? The Marshall attacks again. Report the incident with brass blade in mortal frames, but neither in the position of master of force. Alright, we need to rescue people. Let's go. That's what we do. Yep. Why are you bitching about it? Shouldn't we be helping the helpless? Alright. And now the Yamaja will feel the true power of the dark side. Dark sight flying on chocobo. The dark side of KFC. Yep. Alright, time to save people from being tempered. They seem bigger than they used to be. Get out of here. Should turn on grid. All right, we got this. Are they all did. Okay, move, move, move. Go, 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 go. Oh shit! Seriously? All right. Go, 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 go. Move! Stop freaking out! Get out! Run! Oh, come on! Seriously? Move, move, move! Go, go, go! All 
Alright. Sure, sure. Pay for my insolence. Alright. But a more easy peasy lemon squeezy. KFC every Thursday ten dollar for ten. Ten dollar for ten pieces of chicken? Are you fucking serious? Is it that cheap over there? God damn. I'm um, not even covered in my blood. Yeah, of course I'm covered in my blood. I just chopped them up. What do you expect? All right. Ten dollar for ten chicken pieces of chicken. Holy shit! One dollar per piece. That's cheap. Should go to Jakarta to have like have KFC <laughs> just to have KFC. <laughs> All right, Chief. I saved your. Yep. I saved your pilgrims. I was actually fast and on time. More like Thancred back in the day. Those who have never faced death do not scruple to condemn others to it. Those who know nothing of true sacrifice are weak for their ignorance. In sacrifice there is strength. In strength there is liberation. The force will set us free. <laughs> Alright, let's do Tai Chi and get more Dark Knight power. On the throne of bones, he waits. Serve, save, slave, slay. They come to entreat his judgment. Serve, save, slave, slay. One by one in solemn procession. Oh, that, that's dark. What's going on? On a throne of bones? Blood for the blood god, skull for on the skull throne. I've performed great deeds, and saved countless in the realm, but I'm no Dark Knight. Dark Knight accepts he cannot save everyone, and sometimes he's just fortunate to save himself. Sacrifice is to renounce that which binds you, to recognize which matters, and forsake all that does not. Oh, that's pretty nihilistic. Alright, so back to Ishgard. I didn't I didn't take you for a nihilist free. I thought you were just an edgy boy. And then again nihilism is pretty edgy. It's this. I am guessing that's a single target version. God. The quest that parodies WoW players Exodus to FF. Uh, no. Is that is that a new quest? What what I, I did not hear of that. Where do you even hear that from? You don't even play Final Fantasy. <laughs> Alright, free. What? What's up? What's next? 
Frey has been watching me and he's not pleased with my progress. What? Question my commitment. What? I haven't heard the voice since our last communion, which means I haven't taken his lesson to heart. Oh, you. Frey, are you alright? Morabi Dry Docks. Oh, we're hitting Limsa this time. I don't pay attention to everyone's Facebook status, Devon. Frey has in store for us. It's interesting since he decided to take us to the Morabi Dry Docks. Of all places. What is this? A blue quest? Okay, Frey's here. What quest is this? Oh, it's just a leaf meat. Alright, sup Frey? A friend of his edits came out here, okay? Did extremely foolish and okay. okay. A friend had to get on the damn boat. What's going on? What's going on? Ah uh, yes, it's me. I am a lieutenant, yes, yes. Ah. He's a victim of a heinous crime. He was waylaid by Chitrin bandits. Oh. I'll help, I'll help. Why not? Eh, the children is just... I mean, this is just easy shit. Don't be so mean, Free. Come on. I'm Dark Knight supposed to be like helping the weak? Where am I? Where are they supposed to be at? All right. Ooh. The salt strand. Just make the most out of it. No style, no guile, just chaos. Okay, so you want me to go nuts? No problem. Oh. All right.
Alright, I think I've killed all the red folks. Stolen goods over here. Is that all I need to do? Pretty extreme killing them all just for stealing that stuff. Yeah, it better be something valuable, I guess. Yo. Uh, Frey, you okay? Finish what we started. Uh, okay. Are you sure you're alright? Okay. If you say you're alright. We probably just had an overdose of edge. Alright, they got your stuff. There's something here that does not belong to you? Or something's missing? Everything's soaked with chill chin blood. You demand me to recompense you for getting your stuff back? Are you kidding me? You, sp <coughs> you spineless sack of shite. I kill your enemies, I fetch your things. I do what you people can't do or won't do for yourselves. You're weak, you're helpless, weak, and all you do is want and need. They should have left you to drown in Leviathan's tidal wave. Was Frey a member of the Company of Heroes? Uh, at least this guy is like, um... Scared the sensors back into this guy. But where's Free? Bro, are you alright, man? Felt good, didn't it? Seeing the sniveling red tremble. I think he nearly pissed himself. Oh, he definitely pissed himself. Whoa. Whoa, what's with the dark aura, dude? Come your edge. Come your edge, dude. Show me the power of the dark side. <laughs> All right, he he calmed his edge. A chorus of voice cries out for hero, and he comes. He smiles, he nods, and he remains silent. But he too has a voice. I will be heard. Stand at the precipice, but do not fear to fall. Cast myself into the abyss. I shall soar above free at last. There are other lands than these. Lands we are not known. Us and we shall forever quit this place. What do you mean? Only when I've renounced anything, you're free to do anything. Only when I've renounced everything, am I free to do anything. Is, uh, are, we, are we going deep into Zen Buddhism here right now? Are we supposed to shed all attachments? Unfetter ourselves from our earthly bonds? I guess this really is the Force. And we really are studying the dark side. All right. 
right, free. What's next? Master and apprentice, we are. What's next for the dark side? Yeah, let's go. Whoa, what you do, do it. You sick or something? We should go somewhere warm for a little while. The gates of judgment. Alright, so we're leaving. A moment later, Frey departs. Though in what direction, you cannot seem to recall. Uh, can I just call him over here? Alright, I guess I go to the Gate of Judgment. It's an honor to meet me, oh, okay. The man who bested Shiva every night under Lord Dredamon command knows the tale. Ah, I see my reputation precedes me. A band of... What is them? Giants? Raiding caravan, okay. Oh, you guys really insistent. All right, sure, sure, we'll help. Frey doesn't seem happy that I'm helping people out all the time. That isn't... Didn't he say it's a knight's duty to be like... Helping people in need, you know? Besides... This isn't too difficult. Stun. Ah, no worries. You know, you really should station more guards here. Everyone seems to get ambushed in this tunnel. Alright, I'll kill the giants for you. There were some injuries, nothing serious. Starting looked rather grim. But the moment he fell, they sounded the retreat. It's an honor to fight with me. Mm. Oh, great food soldiers. My martial prowess is widely known. It's truly inspirational, also compassion for the common man. 
I risk my life without thought of fame, fame or fortune. Usually, fame and fortune comes with helping people out, you know? What's wrong? Allegations have been made that I was seen conversing with a corpse in the broom. Um, you're talking about Frey? It, so, so is Frey already dead? What's going on? I, I've been asked to surrender my weapon? What? Whoa. Frey, what's wrong? What the fuck, dude? The greatest moment in our life. I could stop denying the truth that have been staring me in the face the moment we met. What's going on? Fury was dead from the beginning, but I didn't care. I had a sword and a soul crystal, but what I wanted was a mentor. A mentor of gifts and knowledge, a dark knight who could guide me on the path. Isn't that what you are? What are you, just my dark side? You, you have, have you not given me everything I, pro I was promised? Help to hear the whisper of our very soul. What are you? Are you really our dark side? What the, f what the fuck is going on? Oh shit! Everything up to now has been my story. Everything after now will be mine. So he is my dark side.
You would see my underestimate of myself, but no matter. They have borne weakness to the darkness within us. To what lies beneath the mask. You're cheering me on. Hey, Lord Dredemon. A fantastic display of willful ignorance. Wipe the slate clean, forgive and forget. Convince myself that he can be controlled. The warrior of light, our weapon of light. It isn't too late, we can still be free. Know that when I tire of this charade, he will be there, willing to take the reins. So he is my dark side. So Frey was dead the whole time. The three I was talking to was just my inner darkness. Huh. Interesting. Free will be interred with full rights. May his soul rest in peace. I've subdued my dark side for now. Interesting. Interesting. Very interesting. Alright, and I have the Dark Knight armor coffer. Which. Oh. <laughs> right. Let's let's uh cl let's glamour plate this up. Let's see. So wolf from Quirik Quires. And uh, cast glamour, uh, wolf, heavy wolf from gauntlet. Alright, and the pants, wolf, 
from Heavy Wolf from Cuirass. Pants. Oh, that's it. Okay. And let's see, glamour and heavy roof from Sabatons. Ah, he's pretty badass. Pretty heavy armor. Blue isn't the right color for this, though. Can I dye it? Oh, I can dye it. I can turn him pink. <laughs> Ooh. Ross red or wine red? Wine red looks good. Well, let's see. Brown looks nice as well. Ooh, cobble brown. I have to go buy some cobble brown dye. Ooh, can, can, can I visor up? No, there's no option to visor up. I guess I'll just have to. Alright. This is. Alright, so. Let's continue the next Dark Knight quest. I am a true friend of Ishgard. Urgent need of one with my skills. The Behem of Dominion. Okay. Yeah, the heavy armor looks really wonky actually. I might just change back to my school uniform my my yeah my school uniform look. <laughs> Mr. Temple Knight, what do you need? There's a demon among us, a fiend that cannot be suffered to live. Lord Durilamon may be willing to let a vigilante escape. What sorts of hero maims and murders I Okay. What the hell? Are you serious guys? Sir Emmerich will hear about this. Expose me for the abomination that I am. I am the hero of Eorzea, dude. Wielder of the Dark Arts, Consorts of Dragons. Oh, you're one of those kind of guys. Oh, it's another Dark Knight. This is the part where you beg for your life. Whoa. I pray I do not make a habit of following men plotting to kill you and to... <laughs> okay. Oh, you know Frey? Or are you Frey's friend? Freeze did, man. We who consort with darkness are never truly whole. There will ever be a part of us yearning to be free. We trained together, Free and I. His was strength beyond reckoning. 
but alas, it was not enough. I mean, if, if he was beaten by Temple Knights, he, he can't be that strong. It warms my heart to see you carry on his legacy. That you have learned as much as you have, with only his soul crystal to guide you, bespeaks your potential. Are you going to just walk away like that? Oh, he'll discuss with me. Where? Sig Sidorugu. Alright, I'll see you in Ishgard then. Pretty badass armor, I gotta admit. I'll have the opportunity to dye my armor. Let me go dye my armor. This blue armor makes me look like a like an ultramarine. Freaking blueberries. I am not a smurf. my helmet, I'll just dye my armor. Russet brown nicer? Let me check. Ooh, Russet brown looks much nicer. There we go. Good enough. I don't look like a smurf, like a blueberry smurf. Let's talk to... Oh, he was here the whole time! Yeah, I remember this guy. This guy was standing here the whole time. Oh shit. I, I didn't realize. So he was a dark knight the whole time. Well, oh, shit. I fear you do not understand what it means to be a Dark Knight, okay? First of all, it's best you against the clergy, it's true. Sacrifice everything in the name of justice. So must all who walk in. Okay. To many, you will forever be a criminal, a fiend who sows chaos and discord. The people will listen to the lies of our enemy and do the utmost to cast us out as they did the fray. If you're not prepared 
to deal with these circums the consequences. Surrender my sword and soul crystal now. I spare the man who tried to murder me. Mercy, some would call it. Idiocy, that he would name it. Followed him and gave him the mercy. Oh, you dude, you killed that temple knight? The first Ishgardians to encounter Aura saw Trevenians. We had fled the Galamalt's army only to come to a land where we were mistaken for another nation's mortal enemy. They bared still and tried to kill us. But we do not die so easily. We spared them and sent them on their way. And how do you think they repaid our kindness? With fire and blood. With death for every man, woman and child. Make no mistakes, these are wages of mercy. Damn, that's pretty grim. And you have walked the path, you must accept the truth for your enemies already have. Wise but not necessarily true. That's pretty dark. Next quest at level 52. Alright, I can pick this up already now. Let's talk to the little girl. Oh, you nothing to say? Alright. Salted earth. Create a patch of salted earth. And AOE to the ground, alright. Oh, you're gonna talk about something secret? What up? Our master in his final moments spoke to Frey and me in riddles. A heart bleeds, a man weeps, a soul burn. Thence comes darkness to consume. Even in the depths, flame and yours. Submit the flame, harness the abyss. Bray and I did not understand his words. We hoped their meaning would come clear to us in our course of duty as dark knights. And so we carried on following the creed and one day we found her. She was fleeing a unit of temple knights at the time, clearly intent on doing her harm. Frey and I took issue with that and chose to intervene. We went to ground after that. Frey was caught in the streets while fetching supplies. Alright, teach me. Little real, what's up? Sudoku doesn't talk much, not since Free left. The Temple Knights say this young girl is an abomination. What the fuck? Why? She cares for Sudo Sudorgu. The final healers who could see their patient's aether. So skilled were these healers that they could diagnose ailments with a glance. So we're gonna look a Vanu healer and see you ask them to check. Check Riel out? Okay.
Vanu Vanu are not one to parlay with outsiders. They may be willing to receive us if we come with bearing suitable offerings. Gastornis Feathers. Okay. Oh, what the hell, Kelly Cat? The Gallicats are really aggressive. Alright, I got all the feathers I need. I'm gonna travel all the way there to find a Vanu healer. Why can't I just go to the village that um you know that I helped out all the way back then? Oh well, sometimes you just got to do what the quest asks you to do. Pretty relaxing just flying through the sky like this. And a belly fat, I, I barely fit in here with my armor on. <laughs> Look at this. Alright, we're here. Let's see if we can find that Vanu healer that we need. Ah, oh, freak, freaking Gaelic cat. Aggro bat kitties. With offerings, can you look at my friend? Yeah, just have a look at my little friend. See what's wrong with her. So, oh, doing a dance, okay. Hmm. 
This is no child. Ramotains follow us. The one who's scared of the girl? Someone's coming. Temple Knights again. Oh wow. Another hyper aggressive Gaelic heat. Gaelic cats are aggressive as heck. It is Temple Knights. Why won't you learn? They don't answer to the Lord Commander. Alright. So these guys are Renegade Temple Knights. So the Temple Knights can't kill a little girl in the streets of Ishgard because um, it makes them look bad. But... They uh, not beyond attacking us outside the city when no one's looking. Very dishonorable. I'm not hurt. Temple Knights, murderers and thieves who drape themselves in the trapping of righteousness. We are all that stand between them and their prey. I probably should just ask Sir Emmerich what's going on, you know. I'm pretty buddy buddy with him, right? There's no justice for these monsters. We must. Okay. We we'll see them answer for their sins. Oh, calling me? What's up, Rio? Oh, no, we didn't get hurt. Oh, look at that. Sudoku is a tsundere. <laughs> mm. 
Yeah, what about this great spirit? <laughs> he mentioned something about a girl not being a girl. It's really weird. Salted Earth. Great Spirit resides within Riel. Okay. So we need to talk to Gridania's conjurers. Okay. If past indication, you'll be tracking us the moment we leave the city. It's not a matter of of if they will attack us, but when. Wow. Alright, I'll see you guys in Camp Dragonhead. Gridania is not far, Riel is not far. Alright, I'll stay with Riel while he scouts the road to the observatorium. Okay, Doki. I'll protect the little girl with my life. Escort missions. Ugh. There they are, summon the others. Bruh. Holy shit. They're literally riding her down in the, on the Chocobo cavalry. Holy shit. This, this asshole's really want her dead. Run, little Riel, run! Jeez! This guy's a hot call. Escort her to the camp. Gotta escort her to the camp.
All right, she made it. So they made it to Gridania. Have a look at a girl. Tell me what's up. Oh, no, no, no. I'm not skipping this. I want to know what happens. of the world. Be one with the living force. The spiritual presence bellies beyond her ears. Innate power if she radiates akin to the elementals or Dravanians. Why? How? How did she get... Where, where did all that power come from? Tale of the boy and the dragon gay. Young Bishop declared it a heretic tale. The corruption of an older legend in which man partakes of dragon's blood. So is she a heretic? She ingested the blood of an ancient dragon. curious. It seems we got more questions than answers in Gridania.
that corner. You just want to finish your apple. He's being such a sundere. He's going for fresh air while I watch her eat her apple. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's it alright. For a dark knight and an edge lord, he's pretty mad. He's put up the pretty emotional. Alright, are they going back to Ishgard? Alright, I guess they are going back to Ishgard. Oh, I can't jump over the railings. <laughs> Alright, back to Ishgard. Oops, wrong button. Pretty sure they're back at the inn. Alright, after this quest, I'll take a break time. What new skill is this? Plunge. Oh. What level do I have to be to continue the quest? Level 56. Oh, that would be a while. Anyway, break time. I'll see you guys in a bit.
so what's up next it's Hildebrand time so last last we left foot off where was Hildebrand we left off I found the zombies beat the zombies up all right yeah I found the zombies not sure Sangoli desert a gentleman is rather than does Nashu Oh Who summons the Shando dead man? Poor Nashu is so scared. My brothers, lend your ears. A gentleman does not dine upon his guest. Spare this fine gentleman and fair lady your mastications. Withdraw, I say. Harass them no longer. Look up in the sky, it's a bird! No, it's an airship! No, it's the inspector! Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> Ouch. So here's Hildebrand. Hildebrand? Who is this Hildebrand of which you speak? My name is Zombiebrand, devourer of brains, undead of a lot extraordinary. <laughs> you're not an undead of a lot, you're a gentleman inspector. Inspector of a lot. Bombs. Stay your hand, my lady. You don't know what you do. <laughs> if I were the esteemed gentleman, you purport me to be concussive blow of the last <laughs> liquefy mine. If crashing into the ground makes you forget, then an equal explosion of equal force will make you remember. I'll save you, Inspector, or kill you trying. Ha ha ha! 
<laughs> His face. <laughs> Normally, I'll applaud your ingenuity, Nashu, but I would prefer that you found a more elegant solution. <laughs> oh, it's been a while since I've had since I've had an echo dream. Oh shit! Wonderful dream. He slew a dragon and lost his memory. <laughs> he lost his memory. Look at all the zombies. <laughs> so the zombies think he's one of theirs. Hey, the zombies are so friendly. So he became the leader of the zombies. <laughs> Ildebrand, agent of inquiry, inspector extraordinaire has awakened at last. Be the red moon or black dragon, no fiend is matched for his legendary might. <laughs> No, I'm not one of your admirers. Oh, what's going on? He wasn't dead, he was just badly injured and needed to hibernate. I didn't even know people could do that. What the fuck? <laughs> Copious amount of sand, unbearable heat, the Sangoli Desert. Ah, alright. So he's heading back to Uda. Let's hit the Uda then.
Let's change back to Samurai. Alright. to question me about the whereabouts of that deviant running around town dressed in rags. Do I look like a mid reporter for the real eye? <laughs> what the heck? Looking for a naked Highlander. <laughs> Tell him to do something about that damn duelist. Duelist. There's a weapon thief calls himself a duelist. Huh. What's this? This wasn't here before. Huh. Alright. Dealt the zombie problem. Why were they dressing up like dandies? <laughs> Bugger me, bleeding spear. The dead is rising and they're walking the streets of Wuda. <laughs> Reports of my death were greatly exaggerated. Oh, Nashu is dressed up normally now. I kind of miss her previous costume. It was really cute. He's not a zombie, I've checked. <laughs> how do you how do you survive that fall? Why did question Why question divine providence? It was just champion has returned. I shall bring this. Thieving duelist to justice. Alright. I refuse to believe the ever inquisitive, ever ambitious, ever reliable Wyamon is without a single shred of information. Even with dubious relevance. <laughs> the knee assaulted the young woman as well? The audacity! I should fly you to her side at. Yeah, what's up? Hildebrand. <laughs> Damn it, Hildy, I haven't told you the lass's last name yet. Alright. Yellow Moon. Woman with a taste for finer things in life. Alright. Ah, what's with all these pillars? Oh, there's an event going on. Yeah, maybe I'll do that tomorrow or something. So, Weaver's Guild. Weaver's Guild. Here we go. Ah, there we go, Yellow Moon.
priceless possession carelessly ripped from the hands of its owners. The lady weeps, and the wind bears her sorrows to her ears. What gentleman could hear this clarion call and not beg the honor of championing her cause? <laughs> what the f <laughs> I swear to you, here and now, I, Hildebrand, Asian, Enquirer, Inspector and Extraordinaire, shall scar all creation from the deepest pits of seven hells to the very pinnacle of heaven for your pure heart. <laughs> what he said. Alright, what about this thief? Thefts! Oh, pure heart is the only reason thing to be taken. Time of location of theft unknown. Essential details without which we cannot solve the case. Let's reenact the fateful day of the excursion. Alright. There's a lot of hassle to find the duelist and the person who stole her stuff. Alright. Steps of Now. Where is Steps of Now? Alright. It's at the Ethrite Plaza. Yellow Moon Ah, Nashu So cute, she's falling asleep ah, Adorable Okay Pondering whether to buy a new dress A man confessed his undying love to Yellow Moon So she dropped her stuff, okay. Alright, let's go to the Colosseum. Whatever happened here was unrelated. Okay. Novelty gear. Oh, should look at that. Conspicuous crates. The crates are looking at her funny. Okay. Uh, yellow moon. She felt like gambling that day. I was debating which match to observe. Gladiator approached her from behind and confessed his undying love. Why is everyone confessing themselves to Yellow Moon? Struck the man in the face with her purse. Damn, that's knocked the guy out. Holy shit. Lots of crate at Wuda. At the Weaver's Guild at Sun Silk and over here as well. Nashu is discovering something. Is he thinking? <laughs> so this is his thinking pose. Okay. Alright. No, why, why are we going to blow the crate up? Um, okay. Um, Nashu's delight. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, 
Why are there people in the crate? What the f- At the heart of every crime rests a single unassailable truth, reached only by navigating a web of falsehood and contradictions. Hearken to me. <laughs> the shepherd leads his flock, I shall lead you to unrefutable conclusion. The gladiator professed his feelings only to be rejected, physically assaulted in the, in the response, wounding his pride as a warrior and man, resenting her powers, recognizing his weakness. He carries out a more feasible vengeance. He robs Yellow Moon of her weapon, the pure heart. Found a pure heart. This strange man was sneaking around town in wooden crates. They had it. We are not thieves, we are devotees. Yellow Moon is our sun and our star. We should keep her safe from harm. Should she misplace an item from time to time, we'll collect it for safekeeping. What the fuck? <laughs> she has stalkers. Such unbridled fury, righteous indignation, we should be glad to accept the goddess's punish. What the fuck? What? Simps! They're simps! Those tests were carried out by a single individual, you imbecile. Well informed woman. The culprit is a duelist. He claims the, his victims' weapons after defeating them in single combat. If your power of observation is as great as you claim, you have deduced these buffoons in the boxes were incapable as such. Ellie, reporter in a referral eye. Inspector Hildebrand, gentleman inspector, agent of inquiry. You're looking well for a dead man. I would assume you have you like to meet one of the duelist victims? I will introduce you with pleasure. You would be willing to share such precious information with me? Your generosity is commendable, Miss Ellie. May this mark the beginning of a long, beautiful friendship. And then they both run off. <laughs> I haven't told you anything yet. <laughs> I suppose you're the imbecile's friend, I gotta help him. Humphrey, adventurer named Humphrey at the Golden Bazaar. This Hildebrand is adorable. Hildebrand and Nashu. They're adorable, they're so cute. <laughs> Alright. Ah, Humphrey. You alright, dude? Victim of a marauding duelist. Yeah, he was challenged by a duelist not long ago. He found a warrior of light. So, this guy claims to be a warrior of light. Uh... Maggie attacked to the right, Maggie attacked to the left, stuck in the middle with Master Low. <laughs> Is that what you call Master Low? He's one Master Low. Uh, this guy is full of shit.
He lost and surrendered a sword that was not his own. Oh man, dude. You borrowed this guy's father's blade? Did him to take it to a smith for restoration. Paid him gill and then he lost it in a duel. What the f- What an ass. He even lost his hair because he lost his sword. Poor guy. Holy shit. So stressed. He beat the shit out of me and took the old man's sword. <laughs> He used the gill to pay the healers. <laughs> oh no. First you claim a legacy not your own, then you beg others to help you with your own problems of your own making. What of Elazor's golden flowing locks? How will you forsaking young and Humphrey help them? Oh wow. Alright, so we question the people, try to figure out where the duelist went with his sword. Okay. Is yeah, Sudabang gonna like get new clothes? The blade was a rare and ancient relic. Oh dear. Alright. Let's question the people at the bazaar. I guess he doesn't have any idea. That's a traveling antique vendor. Boy should be a shame of himself, robbing poor Eleazar of a priceless family heirloom. Never trust a f adventurer who claims to be warrior of light. Thieves and tricksters, a lot of them. Consider giving Elizo a counterfeit blade? No, that's kind of fucked up, dude. Wasn't much to look at, but at least it was authentic. Hmm. Yes, this is the traveling antique vendor. No knowledge of a legitimate antique van, okay? Anywhere he determines to be of dubious quality. Discarded to the east of Camp Drybone. A well intentioned ruse might put poor Lazarus' heart at ease, spurring the rejuvenation of his flowing golden locks while we continue to search for the genuine article. Alright, so we're gonna search the spring, okay. What kind of fool parades himself in an outfit like that? Or is he some sort of mama? <laughs> Everyone is questioning Hildebrand's fashion sense. He should probably get changed. He's been dressed in the same outfit ever since he dug himself out of the ground. Pretty sure it smells pretty bad.
and they are all Ellie and Ashu are looking for a sword in the springs, okay? It occurs to me I'm not yet fully recovered from my accumulated injuries. It would be prudent to not immerse my body in water. Not without coating with a little liberal application of salamander oil. My dearest mother tended to my childhood scraps just so. Uh, use salamander oil on Hildebrand. Um, okay, kinky, sure. Uh, the comforting scent, though, as though I'm a child in her arms. Before it dries, knead the oil into my aching flesh. Um, massage Hildebrand. Do you really have to strike a pulse while you? Fine. Jeez. This guy. The pain multiplies metaphor gently, gently. Okay. Um. Uh, okay. Do I really have to keep massaging you? You doing that just like oh yes <laughs> now once more with feeling um bruh <laughs> what the fuck dude you really making me massage you kill the brand come on all right I spy with my inspector eye. Alright, let's search the pool. Let's look for clues. There's a cave here. So I found a worthless bottle, a useless rock, and an irrelevant pot shard. <laughs> okay, some clues. No sign of the sword. Are you okay? Oh wow, you are right, you tripped over a sword. Oh shit, he sneezed. Did you catch a call? <laughs> it's bad for your health to conduct investigation in those clothes. She has a few bottles of hair tonic for Elazo as well. <laughs> you really believe that he has golden locks? Alright. Let's get back to the bottle, man.
Never expected you to go to such lengths for two strangers without a thought of reward. Altruism is a rare trait these days. It is. It's commendable enough when you know where to look. A gentleman recognizes the good in every soul and understands that none deserves to be forsaken. Spoken like a true gentleman. Do your garment bags to differ. <laughs> I still dress in the zombie clothes. Brought a change of clothes, a supply of tonic from the peddler in Pearl Lane. <laughs> Eliza is so happy with the hair tonic. What the fuck? <laughs> oh shit. There's something lodged in his forehead. A missive from an adoring admirer? <laughs> Look at that the guy just putting the hair tonic on his head. I shall climb to claim the collector's blade. Huh. The duelist wrote this. He's daring you to stop him. The facial expressions on Hildebrand. <laughs> if I'm the duo to do this, I must dress for the occasion. Hi, <laughs> Hildebrand, agent of inquiry. The Spectre Extraordinaire accepts your challenge. So bold, so majestic, just like a warrior of light. A gentleman of light. <laughs> Holy shit, he has hair! <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Far from the strongest of sorts. Blue skies in the rolling desert. How much longer must I seek the Blade of Legend? What the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Episodic shit. I 
I know that spear is the one I found buried with pumpkins. Pumpkins sort of remind me of... No, it's gone. Never mind. Nashu is so cute. What the fuck is this? <laughs> Alright. I think I'm good for now. I'll, I'll continue this bullshit the next, the next stream. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Alright, I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>